Welcome to Dave's Diaries in France. Enjoy the video. Dave's Diaries in France. Hello, everyone. Uh, just a quick update. Today, I've installed one of these automatic dehumidifying fan things. It's uh, linked to the um, the master VMC, so it's 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 also got a uh, humidity detection device in it. And because this room still has quite a bit of humidity in it, um, this is why it's still on. Um, but uh, it looks really good. Oh, and uh, I've started. Uh, putting uh, a bit of plaster on the uh, the boxing in which has to be sanded down and you know made pretty um, and I've started doing the same on this side but again I've just got to make it pretty once it's uh, painted and everything it'd be good and uh, now the exhaust for this this uh, expel air because in this corner is going to be the, the the shower um, the outside is, uh, is follow, follow me, excuse the dark. It's a bit bright, it's a hot one today. Really hot one today. And the outside, like this. Pretty cool. And, um, when it stops, I don't know whether you can see inside there, you've got them little doors. When it stops, them little doors close. So you don't get any ingress of, um, of water when it's a horizontal rain type of thing. So that's what uh, I've been doing today. So all is good, all is good. Um, heard another update, well we've had uh, various updates um, uh, regarding Una. All is good, all is great, it's been two weeks now or ten days or whatever it is. So um, Una's new parents, they love it a bit, um, but they're on a three week trial to see whether they, they want to keep her. I think it's heading that, heading that way because the kids, kids love her, they adore her. And um, she keeps on sending us photos. We had the latest photo last night um, after her first um, bath, because <laughs> they've only got a bath at their place. And, uh, oh, she looks so angelic, so angelic. It brought both of us to tears. Um, they, they, they have said, uh, come and see her. Uh, and uh, we're, we're gonna see her after they've officially adopted her. Um, uh, I don't know what I'm going to be like, <laughs> but you know, I mean, we've always got the memories, uh, which is good. It's really, really good. But I'm so happy that I think she has found her home for life. And uh, I'm really over the moon with that. So what other things can I tell you? Um, not a great deal. Um, it's been Scorchio. In the Mayenne, uh, it's been nice, uh, but very, very warm. So um, every day is a leak day, if you know what I mean. If you know what I mean. So I get st sticky, wet. Um, so we bought a new door today. Uh, that's going downstairs in the jeet to separate the downstairs from the upstairs. The my part from the upstairs. Um, Hopefully I'll be fitting that in the next few days because um, I've got an old old friend uh, testing the jeet out for free um, to give us some um, feedback on on how we can improve it if if at all. Um, so that's really good. Even though the first feedback we had from uh, uh, four of our friends, I think it was November time. Um, they loved it, um, but I mean, 
my old mate is a straight talker. <laughs> I'm not saying my friends, my other friends weren't straight talkers, um, but I'm, I'm just saying he shoots from the hip, pulls no punches <laughs> about certain things. But it's, yeah, it's, it's the way he is. But I'll, I'll be looking forward to his feedback. So he'll only be sleeping there and making his tea or whatever. I'll fill the fridge with certain beverages. And uh, so, yeah, that, that's going to be good uh, when he comes down, even though he won't be doing a great deal on the first couple of days because it's bank holiday. Um, and as we know, bank holidays, new noisy stuff. So I'll, uh, I'll, I'll look that as I go along. So... Um, so wait for the next update. Catch you later. Right, that's the sheet, I think, ready. Everything's nice and clean, everything's on. Pictures are up, I think look pretty good. Still a bit sparse, we need more pictures in here. Everything is dusted. I might do a once over tomorrow. I'm going to have to adjust this, because it comes too far out. So I'm going to have to adjust that. See what the missus says. So, yeah, it's ready for occupation. Oh, I've just seen a cobweb. I missed a cobweb. How did I miss that? Got it. No more. Oh, God. Things you spot once you've been... Once you you think you've gone around the place, uh, everything's good in here. Yeah, no cobwebs. Cleaned all around the windows. I tell you where they tend to get is in these corners. But apart from that, pretty cobweb free. Pretty spider free. Pretty bug free. We did uh, last year get a load of stink bugs. Uh, but they seem to have disappeared this year. 
Um, we have done it. We have, we've not had any. Oh, it's just started raining outside. So yeah, all is good. Would you live in a place like this for two weeks, or a week, or a few days? I would. It's better than a, considering it's an old farmhouse. It's better than some of the Airbnb we stayed in. It's spacious, it's got all mod cons. It's not claustrophobic. I think this will mark it really well. So we've got the door. We've got the door for here. It's on the A-frame down there. Um, we need to dedicate a day to that because it's, um, it's um, uh, what do you call it? Not a thermal door. Sound, it's a soundproof door. Oh, what's it called? Anyway, soundproof door. And it's, it's quite dense and heavy. So it needs two of us. So we'll be fitting that in the next couple of weeks. As soon as that's fitted and painted, job done. We mark it. How cool is that? Oh, and fibre as well, Friday. It's exciting. It's really exciting. Anyway, I'm off to our doer upper. Got a bit of sanding to do. I'll catch catch you up when uh, I'm I'm in there. See you later. Right. I know this video is a bit of a hodgepodge, but that's how it is. Um, I'm I'm changed because because my previous clothes were soaking wet through just to sweat um, what's the male menopause called is it andopause or something and andropause perhaps I'm going through that anyway uh, boxing in done boxing in done a uh, bit of repair work there. Expel air in. Just got to fine tune it for for the humidity for the room, which but will be a bathroom. So it's it's got to be what eighty percent or thereabouts, or something like that. Um, eighty or ninety percent humidity. Then it kicks in. I'll be happy with that eighty five, maybe. I don't know. Uh, so that's that done. Nothing done upstairs. I've just done some. I'm preparing some corner work. So I'll put some scrim in. I don't know whether you can see that. Scrim. This uh, paper stuff that um, is used over in France uh, heavily. Um, I, I just don't agree with it. Or it doesn't agree with me. I can't seem to. I mean. I did use it on this paper and I just can't get on with it. It just doesn't come out right. So I'm going to have to redo this. Um, but Scrim, Scrim seems to work. Well, it works for me anyway. So, uh, yeah, we're cracking on. We're cracking on. So, uh, yeah, this, this video's not there, really. It's just um, after Una's gone, it's like, it's two weeks now. It's like um, something's missing. She's missing. Still can't come to terms with it. Like I said before, I'm, I'm dreaming about her. Well, that's not right. Uh, who'd have thought falling for a golden retriever? Oh, well. Anyway, I'm going to put this up. Um, I, I, I probably won't get a 
good response at this time. But um, let's wait and see. Got loads, loads of work this weekend. Got to uh, do the uh, border hedges around home. So that's going to be hard work, but it needs doing at least twice a year. So I think it's too much. I think we should dig the lot up and put a fence there. But that's me. Anyway, I'm going to go because I'm, I'm waffling on a bit. So um, I'll catch you later.